This week has been a whirlwind in the tech world, with Google I.O., their big annual developer conference, showcasing their latest innovations to assert their dominance in the AI space. However, just as Google thought they had everyone's attention, OpenAI made a major announcement of their own, intensifying the competition. Let's break down their respective announcements, the exciting new developments, and what it all means to determine who is truly leading the AI race and why. Starting with Google I.O., Sundar Pichai and his team unveiled a slew of new updates, primarily focused on AI. The highlight was Gemini 1.5 Pro, which features a 2 million token context window. This allows it to handle vast amounts of data simultaneously, such as processing two hours of video or 60,000 lines of code in one go. They also introduced context caching, which reuses tokens at a lower cost, making it more affordable to utilize such a large context window. Google also announced Firebase Gen Kit, a tool that integrates with their AI model to simplify building AI-enabled API endpoints. Additionally, they rolled out Project IDX, a browser-based version of VS Code now open to the public. Another notable introduction was Firebase Data Connect, which brings PostgreSQL to Firebase, a highly requested feature among developers needing robust data handling. Just as Google was about to steal the spotlight, OpenAI made a surprise move on Monday, hours before Google's I.O. event, by unveiling GPT-4 Omni. This new model, faster and cheaper than GPT-4 Turbo, combines text, vision, and audio into a single system. What sets GPT-4 Omni apart is its ability to seamlessly switch tones, from casual chat to dramatic or soothing bedtime story voices. OpenAI also revealed plans to bring GPT-4 Omni to the iPhone, potentially giving them an edge in the race to dominate mobile AI, as Google is also striving to get their AI, specifically Gemini, onto Apple devices. In practical applications, OpenAI's GPT-4 Omni is setting new standards, understanding not only words but also context, tone, and visual elements. This capability is revolutionary, making virtual assistants, customer service bots, and personal companions that interact like humans a reality. In comparison, Google's Gemini 1.5 Pro, despite its impressive context window, still feels somewhat robotic. Google is integrating AI into everyday tools, enhancing email summarization in workspace labs, and adding AI overviews in Google search. While useful, these features lack the wow factor of OpenAI's multimodal capabilities. OpenAI's GPT-4 Omni is true multimodal AI, understanding text, images, video, and sounds. Google's project Astra, similar to GPT-4 Omni, can answer questions about visual memory, but lags in natural voice response and speed. Google also introduced the Vo model, a generative video model producing high-quality 1080p videos. Although promising, it doesn't yet match the clarity of OpenAI's offerings. Leadership-wise, OpenAI recently saw the departure of Ilya Sutskever, their chief scientist and co-founder, which is significant given his contributions. Despite this, OpenAI CEO Sam Altman assured that their mission continues under new leadership. Meanwhile, Google remains steady in leadership and has been aggressively innovating. They announced new hardware like Trillium TPUs and Axon CPUs to support their AI ambitions, crucial for scaling their AI models. Public perception plays a critical role, and recent polls show that 90% of people found OpenAI's updates more exciting than Google's I.O. announcements. OpenAI's ability to captivate and generate hype gives them an edge. Google's features, while solid, often seem to lack the immediate impact of OpenAI's innovations. Looking ahead, OpenAI's iterative approach aims to accelerate the development of AGI, artificial general intelligence enhancing each generation of AI systems. Google focuses on integrating AI into practical applications, making it essential in everyday life. Both companies are committed to safety and alignment in AI development, with OpenAI dedicating significant resources to safety research. OpenAI appears to lead the pack with rapid innovation and strategic releases. Their GPT-4 Omni's integration of text, vision, and audio is a major leap forward 
positioning them as leaders in multimodal AI. However, as both companies push AI boundaries, the real beneficiaries are the users in the broader AI community. This competition drives innovation, leading to more advanced, useful, and exciting AI technologies. If you like the video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell.